Hello everyone, let's take a look at the installation, launch and activation of the Telegram Expert software. First go to the Telegram Expert Pro website there will be a download link here. But first we need to disable our antivirus or all the antiviruses that are on the computer. Basically the default on the computer is Defender. Go to Defender or search for it in the search. Click on Virus and Threat Protection, Manage Settings, and turn off all the checkboxes that are here. Everything, everything, everything. So that our antivirus does not remove the software when downloading it and the software is safely installed. Next, go to the Download tab on the site. On the site you need to select the language in which the site will be in the first place. It can be English and Chinese. Accordingly, the version of the software will be downloaded in this language. Go to the download. Here we have the minimum requirements for the software to work. Click download. We download the software. Launch it. Click launch. You need to install it from the administrator. Accordingly, for all users that are available, click set for all users, recommended. Confirm, select the language, this is the installation language. That is, the installation of the software, and not the language of the program interface itself. We choose the one that is more convenient for you. Read the license agreement, click, I accept the terms of the agreement, click next. Next, we need to choose where to install our software. That is, the software is now installed in a certain folder and a shortcut is created on the desktop with this software. And the folder itself will be located where you install it. Specify this folder where to install the software. Click, for example, create an icon on the desktop if you need to. Click next and click install. That's it. Then the program is installed. We have it installed in the specified folder. That is, if we go in. Then we will see that the software is installed. Here it is. And I created the installation file of the software. I made a shortcut to the software. Click run. Tick the launch box and click next if you have software at startup. Here it is that it hits various errors. Close it and move on to the software shortcut. Run it as an administrator. Confirm. And now the installation of the software and the download of additional files will begin. All this time, our antivirus has been disabled. The software downloads the necessary data and is automatically updated to the latest version of the software. The download speed depends on your internet connection. If you have a VPN enabled, for example, and you see that the download speed is too slow, disable the VPN. This happens when it is enabled next. The software asks us to enter the key. Accordingly. Here the key is not the one you had before. For the release of the Telegram Expert version, a new key is supplied. We insert it, and it looks like this. That is, Expert RU, since we have the RU version of the software, the hyphen and the key itself. Paste and press Enter. That's it. Then everything is loaded downloaded, loaded, everything is installed. A software window opens, so we need to go to our antivirus. Because if you plan to turn it on in the future, that's what you need. For further use of the computer or it will turn on, we need to add software to the antivirus exception. Go to the protection of viruses and threats. Manage settings and add or remove an exception at the very bottom and add it to the exception and find our software.
the software shortcut is also added to the exception. We also add the Unis file to the exception and this Unis file too. And let's also add the folder where the software is installed. Now, in the case of rebooting your computer, when you turn on your antivirus, it won't delete software files, and everything will work as it should. That's it. The software has launched. It has opened. Then go to the software settings and set it up. Watch other videos. Other videos on working with the software. That's it. The software is installed and in the settings we can see that the software is activated. If, for example, when you started the software, you rebooted your computer or something else. For example, you updated Windows and after restarting the software, you have software. Let me remind you that the software must be run as an administrator. If you don't want, for example, to right click every time. Run as administrator, you can go to the properties by clicking on the shortcut here. Go here in compatibility, here you can check the box. Run this program as an administrator and click OK and save. In this case, the software will always run as an administrator by default. Here you can customize the design yourself, for example, your workspace. If, for example, you click on a design, if it is too small or too large for you, you hold down the control key and use the mouse wheel to customize the design as you need less more. Accordingly, you see how convenient it is for you. Depending on how you find it more convenient to use it. That is, these are all the main points, and if you, for example, fail to activate the software, that is, this is when Windows was updated, the computer configuration settings changed. In order for the software to reactivate it, you need to reset the binding on your key to your device. That is, to your hardware, since the key is tied to the hardware. The reset of the binding on the key is done in the sphere. We have a bot there. You will learn about this from the video on registration in the sphere. That is, you reset the binding and re-enter the console when the software has loaded and opened. Insert the key, press enter after resetting the binding, and the software is perfectly activated. In principle, there is nothing complicated. In short, go through the points again so that you absorb the information. Go to the website telegramexpert.pro disable it before doing so. Accordingly, the antivirus is completely checked, then go and download the installation file. Install the software in the desired folder, that is, since you only have a shortcut on the desktop. Everything else is in the software folder, that is, here is the software folder. Here is the folder where the accounts are uploaded and they appear here in the active ones. When you transfer the files here, the account files, JSON plus session, this is the software folder here. Accordingly, after installation, add the entire program. Run the software as the administrator, add files and the folder to the antivirus exclusions. If you have other antiviruses, you need to do the same with them, so that they do not delete some software files during the operation of your computer's software and you do not have to, for example, reinstall and fully use the software.